Uh, I'd like to take a moment to thank two golden souls in the room. And that's Graham Nunn, David Stavanger, my publishers. Small yeah. Change Press. I thank them for having faith in me. Uh, every time I go to Brisbane, something magical happens, and, and that was one of those moments, is meeting those two gentlemen. Thank you so much. Um, oh, this is fun. Now we're going to let the rock band off the leash a little and uh, do my seven-day dream journey. Dream I've invented of edible pants. They are a huge hit. My black bean flares are the most popular. You come over to my house wearing a pair of straight leg coconut rice jeans with egg noodle stitching. When I offer to eat the pants off of you, you accuse me of creating my whole edible fashion empire as an elaborate excuse to get you naked. And then I realise you're right. I dream I have to speak at a funeral. I don't know who is dead, but I feel somehow sad anyway. I speak of the deceased raising their need for the first time as a child. When my eulogy is over, all the dead rise from the surrounding graves and applaud loudly. You aren't dead, but you seem proud of me anyway. I'm being tailed by a hermit crab who's really a private detective. To disguise himself, the crab places shells over everybody I know. This works, I can no longer tell which shell contains a private detective. You aren't in this room at all, but I suspect that you hired the crab. go to the snow together. I'm so nervous of spending quality leisure time with you that my body grows extremely hot. My feet melt the snow all around me. There is no snow left. All the other skiers get mad. The forest animals come out. A fox speaks to me and says, love isn't supposed to be like this. Then I wake up and realise I've left the heater on next to the bed. I dream that your father is Darth Vader. We're watching the Olympics together. I ask his permission to marry you, but he's ignoring me because the swimming is on. I photo a remote at him, but it just bounces off his big black helmet. You walk in the room and smile at me. I blush and my left arm falls off. I don't go to bed, so I don't dream at all. I smile stupidly at you from the other side of the dance floor, and I try to think of a sexy mood to attract your attention.
We're walking up a hill together. We smell like old people. I'm wearing a flannel nightie and you're wearing rocket lettuce pants. Your lettuce is wilting. We're late for dancing lessons. But you don't seem worried. At all.